Hello, you're watching the Auto Advisor channel. Ever found yourself baffled by an error code P0171 on your vehicle's dashboard? You're not alone. This error code, also known as System 2 Lean, Bank 1, can throw a wrench into your vehicle's performance, causing issues ranging from ignition misses to unstable engine performance. What this code is essentially telling you is that your engine is running on a mixture that's too lean. What does this mean? Well, it's when the engine takes in too much air and or the fuel system injects insufficient fuel. This imbalance between air and fuel can lead to a host of problems for your vehicle, such as delayed response to the gas pedal, jerky acceleration, dips in idle, and overall inconsistent engine performance. But don't worry, identifying this error code is the first step towards a solution. So let's delve into what causes this error and how to troubleshoot it effectively. So, what causes this lean mixture that triggers this error code? Let's delve into the mechanics of it. One of the main culprits is the air mass consumption sensor. If this becomes contaminated, it can't correctly track the amount of air being consumed. This can lead to the engine taking in too much air and creating that dreaded lean mixture. Another cause can be a vacuum leak. This is when air slips into your engine that hasn't been metered by the engine control unit. Just like the air mass consumption sensor, this can result in too much air in the mixture. Now, let's talk about the EGR valve. This little guy is responsible for recirculating exhaust gases. If it's not closing properly, it can let in too much air. Additionally, if the EGR differential pressure sensor is broken, the EGR valve can consume too much air, further contributing to the lean mixture. But it's not always about too much air. Sometimes, it's about not enough fuel. This can occur if there's insufficient power to the fuel pump, if the fuel filter has resistance, or if the fuel injectors are dirty. Leaks in the fuel pressure regulator can also cause this issue. Now that we know the causes, let's map out a plan to diagnose error code P0171. Let's start with the injectors and the fuel mixture feeding mechanism. These little guys squirt fuel into the combustion chamber. If they're dirty or not firing properly, they can cause an imbalance in the air-fuel mixture, leading to our error code. So, check them for blockages, leaks, or any other issues that could affect their performance. Next on the list, we have the intake and exhaust manifolds as well as the corresponding hoses. These parts help regulate the flow of air and exhaust gases in and out of the engine. If they're not sealed tight, it could lead to too much air getting into the system. So. Make sure to inspect these parts for any signs of damage or wear that could lead to leaks. Now, let's move on to the air mass and oxygen consumption sensors. These sensors monitor how much air is entering the engine and how much oxygen is left after combustion. If they're not working correctly, they can send the wrong signals to the engine control unit, causing it to adjust the air-fuel mixture incorrectly. So, check these sensors for any signs of damage, contamination, or malfunction. Now, how do we go about these inspections? Well, it's a process of elimination. Start with the most likely culprits, like the injectors and the air mass sensor, and work your way down the list. Use special cleaning tools and solutions to clean the sensors and injectors, but be careful not to damage them. The most common reason for error, P0171, is clogs in the airflow rate sensor, or MAF. The sensor's response to changes in air mass consumption can slow down due to accumulated dirt on the wires. These can be cleaned with special electrical or carb cleaner. If cleaning doesn't solve the problem, you might need to replace the sensor. Remember, diagnosing an issue like this takes time and patience. It's a process of elimination and you might not find the problem on your first go, but keep at it. With these steps, you're well on your way to resolving this error. Now let's get to the heart of the matter. How to fix error code P0171. Firstly, we'll focus on cleaning the airflow rate sensor. This sensor, often clogged with dirt or contaminated by fuel vapors, needs regular cleaning to function properly. These contaminants can cause the sensor to send signals indicating insufficient air mass in the mixture, leading to a poor mixture, and ultimately, this error code appears. To clean this sensor, use only carb cleaner or electric appliance cleaner. Spraying these substances on the sensitive parts should do the trick. Be cautious though, other substances might damage the sensor. 
Moving on, checking for vacuum leakage is another crucial step. If the issue doesn't lie with the airflow rate sensor, then a vacuum leak might be the culprit. This leakage can occur anywhere in the inlet piping and at the outlet of the throttle body. So be sure to inspect where the vacuum hoses and the intake manifold are connected, the throttle body gasket, and the inlet manifold gaskets. Also, check for any mechanical damage to the hoses of the crankcase ventilation mechanism and whether the fuel vapors and plugs on the intake manifold are caught. Lastly, it's important to pay attention to the exhaust gases mechanism near the oxygen sensor. This entire mechanism should be tight, especially in the half-meter areas before and after the oxygen sensor. If it's not, the sensor's information can be incorrect, for instance. If the corrugation burns out, it could trigger error code P0171. To sum it all up, troubleshooting with this error code involves a thorough cleaning of the airflow rate sensor, a comprehensive check for any vacuum leakage, and a detailed inspection of the exhaust gases mechanism near the oxygen sensor. Each of these steps is essential in diagnosing and fixing this error, so it's crucial not to skip any of them. With these troubleshooting steps, you should be able to fix error code P0171 and get your vehicle back to running smoothly. Having covered the basics of troubleshooting, let's delve deeper into some advanced solutions for this type of error code. If your car has a sensor of different pressures in the mechanism of recirculation of waste gases, DPFE, the error code P0171 can appear when it is defective. These sensors often become inoperable at a significant mileage of the car, typically more than 55000 miles. Rusting of the sensor can impair its ability to react clearly, causing it to provide information about the lack of gases and the EGR valve to open more leading to a large volume of air mass in the mixture and its scarcity. Thus, if your car has covered a considerable mileage, make sure to check this sensor. Now let's talk about the fuel system. As we've discussed earlier, the poor mixture code also appears when there is an insufficient level of fuel saturating the mixture. Therefore, it's essential to check your fuel system thoroughly. Error code P0171 can prevent the engine from maintaining the optimal balance of the fuel-air mixture, which means that the normal operation of the engine can be disrupted until the error is eliminated. Simply resetting the error will not solve the issue. You need to either look for the above-mentioned faults or consider the following solutions. 1. Replacement of the fuel pump. 2. Replacing the fuel filter. 3. Replacement of the fuel pressure regulator. 4. Replacement of the engine control unit. 5. Replacement of one or more fuel injectors. 6. Replacing one or more oxygen sensors. 7. Replacement of the mass airflow sensor. 8. Eliminating air sucking in the fuel circulation system. Remember, dealing with error code P0171 involves a combination of troubleshooting, regular checks, and possible replacements. Ensure to use the method that best fits your situation and get your vehicle back to running smoothly.